watching a movie now? So yeah, I, I can. Yeah, he got yes. movies. Good. Okay, yeah. good for him. I yeah. love that you support him, 100%. But we are here. Speaking yeah. of support, you're doing something that I think is interesting. And Karam Butler, one of my favorites, uh, right. we love him here. Uh, he's helping you do this, yeah. and you're announcing it on our air. You have created a new basketball league. Yes. Tell us about it and its purpose. It's called Global Mixed Gender Basketball. And it's... We've never seen anything like it before. Tell me about the two teams and who will be on them. Well, the Atlanta Airs is owned by Tiny. So all these teams are owned by Celeste. In case you come down okay. to Las Vegas. I can come to Vegas. Let me grab my shirt. I like a nice the shirt. First the first pick. <laughs> the first pick in the 2017. Here, okay, no, I love that. No, yeah. seriously, congratulations. This is huge. So you yeah. got your first game in Vegas tomorrow. Folks at home, what can they expect to see if they show up tomorrow? A combination of all things, you know, you're gonna see. A hey, so tell me who, tell me who's participating in the co-ed. Uh, uh, it's, it's a lot of, it's a, it's a lot of big names. I'm just telling you. You said Brittany Grinder. I'm no, excited I'm to saying, see she that. She might just be on the sideline chilling or something, but we got. Uh, it's a lot of big. Now, but, <laughs> okay, Axa. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Axa. All right, so let's talk about uh, other NBA hot topics. Yeah, one of the big topics is recently, and I don't know how you feel about this. I know you're big on social media. Your son is as well. Yeah. It's Kevin Durant and him admitting that he may have a, a fake Twitter account to respond to the haters. Why? Why admit that? Why even entertain a Kevin Durant? Yeah. Please. You know what I'm saying? Just go to the Twitter company and say, man, you know what? Let me be y'all spokesperson. How do you how do you stay focused? Because this has to be defeating for your spirit. Trust the process. He have a, a different. I'm trying to take it from a different perspective instead of piling mm -hmm. on. Mm -hmm. Is there is there something that says, well, maybe they do athletes receive so much criticism. Maybe it is okay for them to to shoot back or try to change the narrative mm -hmm. because if it came from his verified page, maybe we wouldn't respect it as much. I don't, I just don't, I'm trying to think of his philosophy as to why he would do that. Well, where I'm from. Other players, more importantly, in the NBA or in professional sports in general, do have these fake pages. He may not be the only one. Nah, right? I'm pretty sure he's not the only one, but.